the power of the human mind to not just guess, but to say with certainty that something is true, that's magical. At its core, it does basic research. Basic research meaning how mathematics can be used in some of the major uh, application areas, thrust areas like fluid dynamics or imaging or big data or cybersecurity. It'll be a place where you can have accidental encounters and accidental conversations with people because you're in the same space. So there's a lot of uh, opportunity for serendipity. The point is that by having a place where important research is being done, conducted regularly on, on that place, you, you do two things. Firstly, it's, it's a place where new ideas are emanating. So you're creating new, new mathematics. Secondly, it's a pipeline, it's a training ground. So students are coming in uh, and learning from the uh, practitioners, from the best people in the field, what's going on in these disciplines. I think that most people don't realize just how much and how sophisticated mathematics goes into the development of new products and how much of a competition there is in the world right now. If you're not the ones who have the best math and the best technology, you just, you, it, it's winner take all nowadays. There will be a day where there won't be brick and mortar banks. As we're operating in that digital economy, in that electronic world, we need to make sure that our transactions are secure, financial, uh, our financial position is secure and our personal information is secure. Without the capabilities that we will be building, that we will be researching in the uh, Centre for Applied Mathematics, that's all compromised. I think about those future problems and this is where the Centre for Applied Mathematics is going to help. You have to compete at a global scale and ideas is what drives businesses uh, forward. We are changing away from a physical space to a mental space. Innovation, businesses succeed now in a mental space. This is the space that we dominate. This is where math lives. We need the Center for Applied Mathematics because we need to apply the research and, and the mathematics inherent in research to solve real world problems. From my perspective, given the green, the green tech space that we're in to a great extent, uh, that means reducing the energy demand in, uh, in the millions of buildings that make up our urban contexts. And just the, the enormity of that task is, can only be solved mathematically. We need the Center for Applied Math because the world is changing very fast and we don't want to be left behind. We could develop in Toronto the world leading high tech. Uh, it's just a question of the will. Maybe it's not about financial um, gain, but it's around gains in maybe healthcare or, or gains in um, education for our children and, and the, the next generation. That's a great thing to be part of. The future comes from the future generations, comes from the children. They need access to this type of math. They need a new role model for what mathematics means to them. We need to do that for their benefit. Math is not magic, as some people think it is, but, but nevertheless, it is magical. 